Nope. Dear Peter, I know it's been a long time, but I wanted to touch base. I had a specific question regarding certain techniques in your most recent book of etudes. I tried to play them, but as never, ever, I can barely make it through without needing to rest. My students, however, have more stamina, but also questions. I've included them in audio form on the tape attached to this letter. If you could get back to me on these questions, I'd greatly appreciate it. As for me, things are fine. I'm still in the city, still playing a ton of bands, and my students keep me busy. It's hard work. I guess it suits me. I hope to see you at one of our concerts soon. Best, Gabe D. Peter Norwood. Nothing there. Up the stairs, maybe. Just the melody again. Peter, I hope you are well. I know our Connor's correspondence has been somewhat sporadic over the past several years. I felt it was timely that I sent you this note. Once again, I find myself recovering from a long-term bout of tenitis. Ten tendinitis. Keep wanting to hide your etude book in a vault and throw away the key. Something about it keeps me coming back. Even as it twists my hands into shapes I won't recover from in months. Anyway, the real reason I'm writing is in regards to my partner. Her name is Muriel, a great vib vibraphonist, a true musician and would have been a great fit in your ensemble. She wants me to give you the record attached to this note. It's her interpretation of your Norwood suite in F minor. She had it pressed especially for you, or so she tells me. Consider this a gift from both of us. Hope you hope you enjoy it. Okay, where's that record needle then? Oh, there it is. Okay, can I exit out of here? I can. Okay, so back down the record uh, club, whatever it was. Now I really want to see what's in the basement. DJ Bogard. Here you go. Can't move.
Oh, is this the pressing that letter talked about? Okay, let's go get a record. I'm guessing it's this one. Yep. Yeah. What the? Okay. That's not what I wanted, but. Is that the last piece? No, I'm still missing the pants, right? Oh, they're gone. Okay, let's go back in and put the mask on. I'm still missing the pants. Oh, the shit. Let's talk to the, the guy downstairs and see what he says. Maybe he knows something. Concierge, whatever he's called. Yes, yes. Wait, what? Yes, of all the people you met, my criticism shows you've been poking around in places you shouldn't, and always we day. Yet perhaps, yet perhaps you can find the means to form. Okay, no help then. So what now? Yes, yes. Where's the last piece? I need the pants. Hmm. 
I've done all the clues in uh, my room. Right. Let's check again, just in case. Okay, I've done this, 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 and this. There's nothing left. Got the shoes in here. Got the jacket in here. So where's the pants? All right, I haven't been here. We meet again. Everyone is talking about the piano. I play it again. Oh. Wait, who? Oh, right. I never, ne never did this. Like the first thing I saw when I came here. This dude down here wanted a strategy guide. Here we go. Nice, nice neck. Jesus. Exactly what I need. Ha! Glance through the prologue. You might be able to beat me. Bruce Closet Key. 308. Jo Jar of Pickles. 308. This must be the pants. Burger. Okay, where's the closet? Oh, it's this. Maybe? Yeah. Yeah, there they are. Button. And the jar of pickles are broken. Another secret room. No idea what's going on. Back up to the Norwood Suite, I guess. Assemble the costume. And then down to the basement. That was good. Now this should be the last piece. You got the costume. Holy shit. And 
and he's gone. And the door is closed. Oh god. I'm locked in. This closed as well. This was this was closed before, right? Oh god. What the hell? Okay, so he went crazy, I guess. What? Okay. No retreat was made possible with assistance of... What? Oh, it's... <laughs> it's credits. The hell? Right, so down to the basement. Where's the fastest way to the basement? Through the main lobby. Through the hand, the hand gate. No, wait, it's not here. Here it is. Decent costume, you can pass, Bob. Thank you. Saving. Nice party going on down here. Hey, you want this? No? Holy shit, they're giants. Just unplug. Sorry to break up the party, but I have something important. DJ Bogart. Who the hell is this? No idea, DJ Bogart. Dolly, who is this? A guest for him. I checked in earlier this evening. You certainly don't look like a guest to me. Much I like your outfit, stranger. You ruined my partner. Utterly. Why are you letting troublemakers into the hotel again, Dolly? A guest had a voucher, Bogart. I'm not gonna just turn guests away. Tonight was no vacancy, Dottie. You knew that. No vacancy. Schmakancy. I know you always leave a few rooms open for... Hey. 
remember that pay cut we were talking about. Really gonna cut my pay over this. Contract you sign, bind your pay scale to your job performance. Plus I get to dock you 50 bucks for every random act of sass. I think we're there, Dottie. Give me no choice. Damn piece of paper I signed 15 years ago, still biting me in the rump. I was right to insist on handshake agreement with you, Nadia. Blue Moose team is ready to fly me anywhere, far, far away from here. Hold on, Borgort. The Hotel Norwood made you. Not us. You'd be nowhere. I'd still be nowhere. If all, if all I do is play shows in the basement of a damn backwoods hotel. I remember when you showed up begging to play all those years ago. Can it, Dottie? That was then. Before Blue Moose Energy Drink helped me realize my full potential. Face it, Nadia. Got an incompetent staff. Joe's security and the food is interesting. And the interlopers just show up and start causing real trouble. I'm sure we can come to an agreement in my office, Bogart. First, give me a reason why I shouldn't get security to serve you another fist sandwich. Yeah, why are you here? What have you got for me? Take this. Muriel, eh? Muriel, so she drop you off here, eh? Should have guessed. No, she's banned for life from this place, right? Why is that? None of you are concerned, Dotty. Guards kindly move this stranger from the building at once. Hold up, Nadia, I have to see these from Muriel. I'm gonna have to listen. Yes, and it's from Muriel. No, no, no way. Come on. No means no. My best interest as a professional selector to feel new music. Especially if it's from Muriel. Yeah, Bogart, you're gonna want to hear this. Don't waste your time on that demo CD. Come up to my room, stranger. We'll listen to the CD together. Yes, yes. Private suite. Oh shit. Meet me upstairs in a minute. May I be excused? Oh, I can move. Well, I'm out of here. Okay. <sighs> Holy shit. hell is this? Come on, Mr. Norwood. Oh, God.
Okay, before I go in here, just... Play. Uh huh. Can't move. Oh shit. What the hell? What's happening? Dude. Stay away from me, dude. I can't move. What the fuck is going on? Oh, okay. I have no idea what uh, I just experienced. But... I'm actually speechless. Well, I guess that's it for me tonight. Goodbye, everyone. Thanks for watching.